Are you guys sick and tired of finding boring rocky planets with nothing to discover? Well then keep watching this video and I will explain how you can increase your chances of finding those lush planets with the rarest resources. Bing, bing, bong. What is going on my fellow explorers? We all know that no man's sky is randomly generated so to say this method will always work is a lie. But what if I tell you that there are four different kind of star systems and each one has its own type. With that I mean a type 1 star is going to have the smallest chance to have a paradise planet with rare resources. Where a type 4 star gives you the biggest chance for that happening. So let's look at the galaxy map here and show you how to spot the best stars. You guys probably already noticed that there are four different colors of star systems to choose from. We have yellow, red, green and blue stars. When you just start out and you fix your hyperdrive you can only go to the yellow stars. This is a type 1 star so a low chance of finding anything good. As you upgrade your hyperdrive you will be able to warp to a higher type of star. So the red star is a type 2 where you need the sigma warp reactor upgrade. For the green stars type 3 you'll need the tau warp reactor and for the blue stars type 4 you will need the theta upgrade. This means without these upgrades you won't be able to warp to a higher type of star system. If you have trouble finding these upgrades you can get them from various crash ships that you encounter on the planet. So get the theta upgrade and warp your way to the blue stars and get the best chance of finding those lush planets. A little side note, the path to the center will only stop on the yellow stars. As you upgrade your hyperdrive you will be able to travel much more distance than the path to the center allows you. In other words, explore and find your own way to the center. No Man's Sky is all about the journey and discovery and no one has the same experience. I still love this game after playing for 30 plus hours and I still get a kick of entering the atmosphere. I'm recording all my best planets and moments to put together in a video for you guys. There's also an Epsu montage coming on the 26th of August. Thanks for all your support guys, it means the world to me. I don't say this enough, but you guys are such a positive light in my life. So keep on shining my friends. My name is Bartieyeo, and if this video was any use to you, drop that like, cause it really helps me out. I will see you in the next one. Later.